Imagine looking into a mirror, but instead of seeing yourself, you see the beginning of everything. Not just your reflection, but the early days of the entire universe. That's what the James Webb Space Telescope was made to do. It looks deep into space and captures light that's been traveling for over 13 billion years. This light comes from the first stars and galaxies ever formed. Scientists expected to see small clouds of gas, slowly starting to come together. They thought the early universe would look calm, quiet, and simple. A place where stars and galaxies were just starting to form, not yet finished. But what Webb showed us was completely different. It found fully formed galaxies, spinning and glowing with light, far earlier than expected. These galaxies had spiral arms, clusters of stars, and even giant black holes in their centers. It was like finding a giant tree when only a seed was supposed to be there. They weren't faint or just starting out. They looked mature, full of energy and structure, even though the universe was still very young at that time. More and more galaxies began to appear in Webb's images. And each one seemed older and more developed than scientists had ever thought possible. It was like the universe had skipped childhood and jumped straight into adulthood. The early universe was much more active than we imagined. For years, we believed galaxies needed billions of years to grow. But Webb showed us they were already formed just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. This means the process of creating stars and galaxies happened much faster than anyone thought. The early universe didn't waste any time. Even more surprising, Webb found elements like oxygen, carbon, and iron in these galaxies. Normally, these take billions of years to appear. That's because these elements are made inside stars. When big stars die and explode, they spread these materials out into space. But these galaxies already had those elements just 400 million years after the Big Bang. That means many stars had already lived and died by then. It also means that the building blocks of planets and possibly life were already around very early. That changes everything we believed about cosmic history. It's like discovering a fully built city minutes after laying the foundation. It makes you wonder what else we've been missing. Then came an even bigger surprise. One galaxy had a black hole more than a billion times the mass of our sun. That should take a long time to grow. Black holes usually form from stars collapsing and take billions of years to reach that size. But this one was already huge in the young universe. This challenges our understanding of how black holes form. Some scientists think they might have formed from huge gas clouds collapsing directly. Others believe dark matter might have helped them grow faster. These new ideas are still being studied and could change everything we know. These discoveries don't just tweak small things in science. They could rewrite entire chapters in our understanding of space and time. Webb also found something floating freely in space, organic molecules. These are the same kinds that make up amino acids, which are the building blocks of life. And they weren't on any planet or tied to a star. They were just drifting through space, possibly since the universe began. This means life's ingredients might have been there from the very start. That's a huge discovery and one that gives us hope for finding life elsewhere. Webb also captured galaxies arranged in beautiful, perfect patterns. Some looked like petals spinning around a center point. These patterns could be from the bending of light by gravity or leftover energy from the early universe. But some scientists wonder if there's more to it. A few have even asked if these patterns are part of a cosmic design. While it's still a mystery, it shows how much we don't understand yet. In quantum physics, the act of observing something can change it. Could our discoveries also be shaping how the universe appears to us? Galaxies forming too quickly, 
black holes growing too large, and molecules appearing too early all suggest the universe is more active than we ever thought. Webb's images challenge what we thought we knew about time and space. Maybe the universe isn't just a collection of stars but something more. Maybe it's a living story, still unfolding, and we're just starting to read the first pages. With each photo, new questions arise. And with every question, the possibilities grow even bigger. The biggest discovery might not be out there, it could be how this changes us here on Earth. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.